Here is my uh, scooter check, I guess. Yay! Um, we got original A bars, uh, Razor A. Kind of suck, but they're sturdy. Homemade grip, like a boss. <laughs> I think this is about 11 and a half inches long, and then 20 high, and then got regular razor deck, yeah, it's not too great, right, uh, razor A wheels, A2, A2 front wheel, guard's still on, I should probably take it off. Uh, everything's stock except the double clamp, the, and the bars, it's bolted of course right there, and I'm gonna probably have to re-bolt it, because, um, it's getting loose, and it's actually not too bad. Like the deck never, I've never broken a Razor A deck, and the only things I've broken on Razor A's are the wheels just get wrecked, um, I break the T-bar, or the fork gets bent, but I kept the guard in so that's why it's not going to get bent. But I'm expecting this one to last a lot longer than a lot of other razors. I mean, like, if you don't want to spend $80 on, like, a pro, and then spend, like, $200 more getting a new T-bar head, uh, uh, head tube and wheels and bearings, it's, it's actually pretty solid. Like... If you bolt it, it's not going to be too bad. If you get good T-bar, it's not going to be too bad. Double clamp, it's not too bad. But, um, the next thing I want to get on this is, uh, new bearings. But other than that, it's actually pretty decent. Patented razor brake. And that's, that's about it. Nothing special. No hundred dollar decks with two hundred dollar t-bars and stuff so yeah that's it